Hi, I'm David Jones from the Manor from Devon Cooking School. I'm here enjoying some wonderful heat from this Morso Camino. But what I want to show you this evening is that the Camino is more than just a patio heater. We can use it for some fantastic cooking as well. What I want to do this evening is grill this beautiful piece of rack of lamb, make a nice tabbouleh salad, roast some peppers for a really simple midweek meal, and do it all in the Camino. So we're just going to get the oven set up, and as you can see, we've got a nice flame burning in there, producing lots of lovely heat for me to enjoy, but also creating a nice bed of embers that we're going to cook over. And we're going to use the Tuscan grill to do our cooking tonight. I'm going to slide that into the oven over the top of the fire, and straight away I can start cooking. So I'm going to heat up some chicken stock that I prepared before, get that up to a nice boil, and put that onto my bulgur wheat to create my tabouleh. That'll just take a few minutes in the flames there to heat up. OK, I can see that's coming up to a little boil now. So I'm just going to bring this round, and in here I've got bulgur wheat a little bit of salt and pepper. I'm going to pour that straight on there. Give it a stir. Probably won't need all of that stock. And I'm going to leave that for 20 minutes or so, and that'll all swell up and create a lovely tabbouleh. So now those flames have died down, I've just got a lovely heat on the grill. Perfect for cooking this rack of lamb. What I've already done this with this is rub it with a little mixture of harissa paste, orange and cumin, a little sprinkling of salt and pepper as well, so that can go straight into the Camino. I'm going to pop that in and just turn it as frequently as I need to for it to cook nice and evenly. A little bit of char, I love a little bit of char on meat, it's fantastic, so I'll just keep an eye on it and keep turning it as necessary. At the same time as the lamb is cooking, I'm going to add a little bit of pepper. Those can go straight on, just to let those soften and get a little bit of colour on them. And as long as I keep a nice bed of embers under there, providing plenty of heat, that rack of lamb should take 15, 16 minutes, something like that. So whilst our lamb is finishing cooking there, you can see that our bulgur wheat has swelled up nicely. And I've got some things to add into that to turn it into a beautiful tabbouleh salad. Nice finely chopped red onion, lovely ripe tomato, and a really nice big handful of chopped herbs. In there we've got coriander, parsley, and chives. And we want lots of that. That just gets a stir together, ready to eat our lamb when it's cooked. Our lamb's had about 15 minutes, I think it's ready to come out. Feels absolutely perfect. Let's bring out some peppers with that. A little bit of this wonderful tabbouleh. North African inspired this supper. Tabbouleh enjoyed in, in the Middle East. I've left a little bit of crunch on the roasted pepper. The lamb is beautifully tender. A little sprinkling of dukkah to finish that off. Condiment, lots of coriander, toasted sunflower seeds, a few toasted pumpkin seeds. That'll give it a little bit of crunch. And with lamb, my absolute favorite, a squeeze of lemon. So that's a really simple midweek supper for two. Harissa marinated rack of lamb, tabouleh salad, roasted peppers, all grilled in the Camino. What a lovely way to eat in the summer and what a relaxed way to cook.